Good morning, Curtis Bay School, the best school in Baltimore. What a beautiful day, and we are so happy to have everyone back with us again today. Let's get this day started with our kindness pledge. Students, please repeat after me. Today, I will have kind words and kind actions. Today, I will have kind words and kind actions. Thank you, students. Thank you, Jack. We appreciate your efforts in demonstrating kindness throughout the day. Remember, no matter what anyone says, no matter what anyone does, you have total control of the words you say and the actions of your body. So always choose kind words and kind actions. Students, we are getting ready. We are almost at the end of the year, but we still have some work to do. We still have some reading, writing, and mathing. That's right, Jack. Reading, writing, and mathing. We still have some reading, writing, and mathing to do. So make sure that you're working hard all the way to the end. Make sure you're paying attention to those outstanding teachers. They are the best in the whole world, aren't they, Jack? They are the best in the whole world, Mr. B. What's that smell? Something smells really good. Well, Jack, we were talking about the teachers. Yes, they are the best in the whole world, but we you must have smelled Mr. B's dinner. Mr. B has this delicious chicken. Let me show you my delicious chicken I have here. I have some delicious chicken Mr. B made on the grill. I have my Raven's plate right there. I'm gonna have my delicious chicken. Uh, in just a second after we finish this video. Mr. B, that chicken smells really good. Can can I have some of that chicken, please? Jack, we have been through this. You know that chicken is for people and you are gonna have tonight for dinner your puppy chow. I don't wanna eat that puppy chow, I want chicken. Students, we know that Jack doesn't eat chicken. He eats his puppy chow. Jack, you're just going to have to enjoy your puppy chow tonight. You're not having Mr. B's dinner. Mr. B made this delicious chicken. I can't wait to eat it. I got everything ready to eat my chicken. Look what I got here. Here's my delicious chicken on my Raven's plate. Have my fork right here. Have my napkin. Uh, I'll, everything I need. Oh, wait a minute. I forgot to get my Coca-Cola with my Limey Jr., Mr. B, go ahead and get your Coca-Cola. I'll wait right here and make sure Luca doesn't eat your chicken. That Jack, he is so good. He is going to watch my chicken and make sure no one like Luca or old Bella comes to eat my chicken. Thank you, Jack. You're welcome, Mr. B. You go, you go ahead and get your Coca-Cola. Everything will be fine right here. I'll wait right here and watch the chicken. You are so good, Jack. He is such a good pal. I tell you, I, I don't know what I would do without him anyway. Um, but now that I think about it, a lot of the little blessings at school told me not to leave my chicken on the uh, table um, because, well, they tell me that you eat it, Jack. No, Mr. B. Remember all those little blessings at school? They tell stories. You go ahead and get that Coca-Cola now. Well, Jack, they do have a point that one time I went to go get my Coca-Cola and I came back and my and my food was gone. Uh, that was when we had an earthquake. Oh, that's right. I remember you telling me that there was an earthquake that day. Anyway, just to be safe, I think what I'm going to do uh, over there, I have a little island in my kitchen. I'm going to take my delicious chicken while I go get my Coca-Cola. I'm gonna put it over here, right here, up here on this island. And that way, it's up high and no one will get my chicken. So let me go ahead and get my Coca-Cola and come back and have my delicious chicken. 